Um, a couple of months ago, Bryson Hill and Gavin saw that they were having a contest of sorts for Google Glass, and they were asking for a very brief description of why you would want to use Google Glass, and uh, if you wanted to, a 15 second video. Sure enough, after Don Wetrick and his innovations class submitted their 15 second video, they were chosen to take part in the beta test for Google's new product, Glass. The Indiana classroom is getting to test the ultimate, coolest, coolest thing we've seen. Right Look at there. this new technology they're using. Glasses to do everything. All right, well, Google Glass is just a pair of augmented reality glasses that it has a little strip of glass right here that is semi transparent. You can see time, recording status, any information that you want to see. Okay, Glass, record a video. This is it. We're on in two minutes. Okay, Glass, hang out with the Flying Club. Uh, Google Glass is, I think it's the simplest way of saying it's a wearable iPhone, um, where you have basically cellular technology and then wireless internet basically in a corner of a glass. And so I can, instead of looking down at a cell phone and looking up, I can simply look through and it's voice activated. So if I want to send a text, I say, Google, okay. And then I can dictate an email message and it'll listen to my words and it'll send it out. Um, meet me in front of Strand Books at two. Oh man, really? Hey there, guy. Hey there, little guy. Sweet. Remind me to buy tickets for Monsieur Gano tonight. My personal plans to Glass is just to try and figure out what we can do with it specifically, like what is every feature of it, find out any uh, applications we can do with my Android phone or any other thing that we can do. Basically I'm trying to associate it with other technology that's already out there. I would actually like to develop apps for Google Glass, that would be really cool. Um, just using them, I just want to see how the interface actually works, uh, if it messes with my vision at all since it will be like right in my face, how easy it is to use and stuff like that. Um, I think one of the fun parts about this is that we don't even know what we're gonna use it for. We certainly have a lot of uh, ideas that are easy. I mean, anything from videoing things, live streaming things. Um, but some of our classes, we're kind of looking into how we can use it um, to use for educational purposes. Uh, we're gonna be the only ones that have Google Glass for a while, and that's kind of a, a unique opportunity for us to have. This is kind of like having the first iPhone for the first seven months and no one else having them. So I, I think part of the fun is just figuring out what can we use them for, and, and I think that's true innovation. Getting a tool that you kind of know how to use, learning how to use it more effectively, and then seeing what you can do with it. Make sure you check out FCTV's YouTube channel for exclusive Google Glass content in the upcoming weeks. For FCTV, this is Brad Alkire.